Brighton woman will be hitting the pavement this Monday to support firefighters. Ann Coughlin's father was a firefighter, killed decades ago battling the Vendome Hotel fire in Boston. As Lisa Greshi shows us, the memory of her father will always be with her, and that's exactly what will be motivating her on Monday. Engine 33, ladder 15, a firehouse dear to Ann Coughlin's heart. I miss my dad every single day. I have two kids he never got to meet. Firefighter Richard McGee, a hero, still remembered on these very walls. I came here with him as a child and he would slide down the pole with us and I was so proud of what he did. On Father's Day 1972, Anne was nine years old. Her father left for work early. He knew his brothers needed him. He drove off that day and we just never saw him again. Nine firefighters, now honored in this memorial, lost their lives when the Vendome collapsed without warning. I'll never forget that day, you know, nine caskets in the Cathedral of the Holy Cross and driving through Boston in the pouring rain, the streets lined with firefighters. Decades and hundreds of miles later, Anne is getting ready to run the Boston Marathon for the Boston Fire Department Relief Fund. She says her dad loved to run. Run. And with each step, she feels closer to him. A lot of times in my training, I feel like the number 33 crops up a lot. I just see it in, in unexpected places. So I do feel like he's, he's with me in this. Her brother, Richard McGee Jr., a Boston fire chief. Her grandfather and uncle, also firefighters. And just as the Boston Fire Department has had her family's back through all of these years, she will run to help have theirs. To get to run by this firehouse and, and feel connected to my dad and honor his memory is just going to be a tremendous feeling. And as soon as she crosses that finish line, she'll come back here to the memorial to place her medal right next to the helmet above her father's name. Reporting in Boston, Lisa Grashi, WBZ News.